Hi, this is Lou Covey, Editorial Director of New Tech Press, and I'm here at the NABTO booth. I uh, interviewed these guys uh, a couple of years ago at another ESC, and I'm here with them at Design West to talk about a product that they, or their product that they put onto an Arduino board. And I'm talking with Raymond Kwong, who is a sales manager for NABTO. Uh, Raymond, what is it that you've got here as on, on this product? So here we have our NAB Duno board here. Basically, it's a development board based on the Arduino form factor. And what this does is that we we actually partnered with FreeRTOS here to for this development board here. A lot of our users are using the FreeRTOS development tool. And this is a development hardware development platform here that allows our customers to uh, develop a zero to ethernet connection. Here we have here on the board is a PIC-18 MCU for microchip here. And we have the ethernet uh, connection on board here. Uh, we have some digital uh, in, uh, IOs here. We have some analog IOs here that allows our users to develop uh, their custom form factors uh, as an adapt to this to this development board. We have we the reason why we selected this form factor, uh, the Arduino form factor, is because it's pretty pervasive out the market out there. Uh, what we've seen is that there's um, there's a uh, large interest and a use base uh, with the Arduino uh, form factors. This board, in addition to the sort of Ethernet uh, capability here, allows you to do some um, prototype here. And there's a demo here that illustrates uh, toggling LEDs on there. There's a temperature sensor. There's actually a button for uh, reset and um, uh, etc. The development board is available on our website, um, uh, uh, napto.com. You can uh, order the boards there on the website. The boards, uh, actually, the connectivity of the boards, uh, how it works with the NAPTO is that there is an ID on the board here, 198.nabduno.net. And similar, to if you were using a, the NAPTO software technology on our, on our uh, website here, uh, on your browser, you would just bring up the NAPTO and you type in the ID here. The ID would be the ID of this uh, identification of the board here, and this gives you remote access to this board. Okay. And our firmware is loaded on the board okay. for you to have that development access. Excellent. Thank you very much. Yeah.